been raining like crazy since we got these beans planted. I think we got them planted, uh, and it didn't rain that next night, but the next, you know, three or four days, it's just been raining and, and crap, and just hasn't been a good time to get back in here and do any tying weed, and everybody would be doing that. But we've got uh, we've got beans up out here. You can see, you can see those rows behind me. They're just good beans coming up, but man, they're just full of weeds everywhere. So there's our bean row. Well, we got all kinds of shit and weeds in in between the rows. So we broke out the old rotary hoe. We're gonna see if we can't flip some of that shit out of there and break open the crust a little bit. So the rest of these little little buggers down here, see these guys are kind of having a hard time. There's probably a few more in there. Yeah, right there. Those guys are gonna die if we don't get them broke open. So, oh yeah, look at that, just green all over. Let's go hammer down and see what we can do. doing a little checking on this ridge here the beans are behind because well they can't get pushed through this crust so we'll get it broke open there they are there's a few of them that are poking through but these others are having a hard time I mean, there's one it's awful cloudy in here too that ain't helping but that's just one little spot It's doing more good than what you think it is and it's hard to tell you what speed sometimes you want to just go like the devil and throw clods throw dirt I don't know if there really is a good set speed for them. maybe I'm wrong so I'm comment down below what the good speed is for these you see these little guys are just they're having a hard time with this top crust and there's a good chance of see there's what we're knocking out that little stuff and it's doing a good job of breaking open and it ain't getting all of it but it's stirring that soil up and killing those weeds anyway we got a chance of rain tonight might be going to get some might not so a little bit of rain coming that'll help melt this back down and those little beans can come right on through Looks good.
getting almost done. Yeah, it's got a couple little little spots over on this side. And a couple long rows yet. We'll be done. short little passes right up there and then we'll be done. This is the driveway where we pulled in and it was so weedy uh, you can still see there's there's still some weeds out here but I mean you know we killed a lot of them there's a lot of that stuff sitting on the surface and that's what you're looking for no we didn't get them all there's still a bunch hooked in there now we got beans that are able to come on through did I wipe a few beans out yeah sure but not very many that's pretty rare but we did a lot of good. There's a lot of white hair roots hanging up here on the surface now. I mean, look at that. That one's still hooked in. That's a button. Cultivator should get that one. But I mean, look at them. They're just scattered all over the surface out here. Now, should we hit them again? I don't know. Maybe. I mean, it didn't even really get that spot. But now I think we're going to call that good. Put the rotary hoe away and probably gonna hook on to the cultivator next first pass uh, and we just did all them bearings on there what do you think you like running the rotary hoe no do you don't like going fast I like going fast you'll you, in about a week you'll wish you had the rotary hoe back on because you're gonna go from 10 mile an hour down to like two you'll be out here for days all right guys Catch you later, and hope you enjoyed the video.